The neuropsych evaluation provides you with a functional um, analysis of a child's brain functioning. So neuropsychologists are specialized in brain behavior relationships and in understanding how the brain works. So in terms of looking at a child who has experienced some type of insult to the brain, we're wanting to know how that child is functioning compared to their age normed group. So that when it comes time for helping that child return to school, we're going to be able to take a look at that child's level of functioning, their, their overall general functioning in multiple areas, um, be it attention and concentration, intellectual functioning, language skills, um, visual spatial skills, and executive functions, reasoning and problem solving. The results of the neuropsychological evaluation will also include the mood, affect, and behavioral sections. Those mood, affect, and behavioral sections can also be used um, to provide accommodations and also provide information to the school regarding a child's level of functioning in those areas. If a child is having mood difficulties or personality changes because of their injury, that too is important for the school to know about dealing, dealing with a, a child who has experienced a brain injury. So it's important that we provide the school not only with the neurocognitive information, but also with the um, periphery mood, affect, and behavioral types of issues that also may accompany uh, a brain injury and oftentimes schools are not quite sure how to deal with that so if accommodations can be put into place in the IEP to also deal with not only the neurocognitive deficits but also to deal with the mood affect and behavioral issues that too can be very helpful for the school and the parents so it's important to have an analysis of all of those areas so that you can understand where that child is showing their difficulties where the deficits are once you know where the deficits are and where they're having problems, then you can develop a remediation plan that will assist the school and assist the parents and assist the child in returning to school at an appropriate level.